everyone, I'm Penny from Your Closet, Your Style. Welcome back to my channel. Here at Your Closet, Your Style, what I love to do most is help you own your style, whatever that may be. We're all different and whatever makes you feel your best is your style and I'd like to help you with that. Today, we're going to talk just a little bit about that whole where now, where later. How do you take what's in your closet now, which for us here in West Michigan, it is late summer, and carry some of your favorite pieces over through fall, and in some cases, late fall or even early winter. So I just thought I'd talk about a couple of different examples that I know I'll be doing and share them with you, and hopefully it will inspire you to see what you have in your closet to be able to do the same thing. And again, own your style. I hope that you enjoy this video and that you'll like it and subscribe to this channel for more. I do have a blog post that corresponds with this video and I will leave a link to that below. So what we're going to do now is just go through a couple of photos and um, I'll talk to you a little bit about what my inspiration was. So here we go. So most of the time I'm talking, I'm going to show you, put up a um, picture of me in the outfit that I'm talking about and we'll just talk our way through it. So here we go. So the first one, as I'm sure you can tell by now, is pretty basic. It is a pair of my favorite jeans and a t-shirt. These jeans in particular are a great pair of straight leg Parker Smith jeans um, that I found recently for a great deal that obviously they're jeans so we will wear them year round. I pair them in this photo with a great um, t-shirt that I've talked a lot about on my channel and in my musings on my blog. Um, it's called the Studio T. It's from J. Crew, either J. Crew or J. Crew Factory. I have it in three or four colors. It wears well. It washes well. It's a great basic t-shirt. So in the photo, I have it paired with um, just a pair of black slides and um, I do have my hair tied back. It's humid and gross. <laughs> and um, this is a typical, not 90 degree summer day, but a summer day. So then <clears throat> we'll move right into the next photo. So the next photo is starting to, as we start to head into fall, um, even today here when I'm filming, it is just a high in the low 70s and the humidity is really low. And actually, if you're not out in the sun, it's kind of chilly. So we're in that in-between phase. I know last night it got down to the 50s and people that were at outdoor activities were chilly if they didn't have a coat. So we've hit that time. So what I've done now is taken the same pair of jeans, the same t-shirt, changed the accessories, including the shoes and the belt, and I've added a great jacket. Now, the shoes I'm wearing, I love mules. You may not, that's okay, but I have several pair. It's a shoe that I actually wear even in the winter as long as there's not snow um, because I just, I love the style of the shoe. This, in, this shoe in particular is a free people slide. I'll try to link it. I don't know if it's available anymore. Um, but I love the gold. Um, I love that shoe. Anyway, I've paired it here with a great jacket from Cabby, and the sleeves on the jacket make it very trend now. It's a bell sleeve. What I love about this jacket, especially for this time of year, is it is what we used to call bracelet length or um, mid arm length, I guess you could say, but it's great for in between because it's not a full uh, full sleeve jacket. So I also love the pinstripe detailing. Um, for fall, we're really looking at a lot of menswear prints and menswear detailing, and I think pinstripe does take you back to that. Um, the other great thing about this sleeve length is as we do head into um, cooler months, change that short sleeve tee for a long sleeve tee and the sleeves from the t-shirt will show below the sleeve of the jacket and it's a great layered look. But I love being able to carry this jeans t-shirt look through every season. I will wear this year round just with different layering pieces. Again, maybe change that short sleeve tee for a long sleeve tee and maybe with a vest or a fur vest, faux fur, 
Yikes. Faux fur vest in the winter and boots with the straight leg jeans or booties. Super cute. Carrying through the basic look or um, the same starting place, so to speak, uh, as you get through there. So again, wear now, jeans and a tee. Wear later, add a jacket, jeans, tee, and jacket. Change the shoes and you are good to go. That's the first look. Okay, the second look. If you at all follow my Instagram, I found this dress by accident, also by accident, half off on sale at the most adorable boutique here um, locally where I live. I just picked this dress up. All right, I'm going to tell you it was only $25. So I am currently, the dress, um, has a great print to it that you may not be able to see in these photos. But so I'm just gonna walk up to the camera and show you the print of the dress because I love it. It has a blue-gray background, if the camera will focus, and um, bird. it has a bird print and the birds have a gold tone to them and almost a dark gray tone and then there's um, beautiful little sprigs of olive green leaves in there so just great colors um, great neutrals for doing all kinds of different things with it so anyway I found this dress so I am determined to wear this dress <laughs> Maybe until I get sick of it, I don't know. But I already have this dress planned through early winter. So I'm going to share those three different looks with you here. So the first one, which is the way I'm wearing it now, and I've already worn it this way a couple of times, is just paired with a long necklace. And um, in the picture that I'm showing you, I've got on a really cute pair of uh, nude colored slides and they have a block heel on the back so they do have a little bit of flair to them but um, perfect for this dress just a nice neutral especially with my pale legs um, but I think this is just a great dressy casual look um, you could easily swap out those sandals for a cute pair of flat sandals and get a more casual vibe to this dress for again for wear now and I think that's a great thing so then let's fast forward to September, um, late September, October. I now switch over and I'm pairing the dress with um, a, a pair of boots. That's a lot of pairs. I've, I'm wearing the dress here with over the knee suede boots with a heel. Luckily that caramely color of the boot is the exact same shade as the shade of the birds. The print in the dress it pulls the look together so well I'm really pleased with the way this came out um, I can see wearing this for a date night for a girls night out um, for uh, just a ton of different things because you can dress it up a little more based on what jewelry you wear or wear it a little more casual again based on jewelry and hair and, and, and how you style the look and what bag you carry and all of that but this is a great piece all right then one more the dress again haha -ha, um, for early winter late fall and in this photo I have paired it with a faux fur vest and a shorter boot but a darker color um, depending on the weather and I will let the temperatures tell me I'll either put a tight on with this boot or I will wear um, I won't wear tights and again you'll see my pale skin um, I could easily swap out those dark chocolate lower boots for the suede boots I wore in the other photo and I think it would be a great look what I love about this whole pairing is that with that vest, you totally see what season we're in. And the dress looks just as good in that season as it does now in late summer with a pair of sandals. And that's how you wear now, wear later. I think this is a great way to carry this through. So I hope from the two outfits that I showed you today, the jeans and the t-shirt, and then the cute dress, and how I showed you wearing them now and then adding a couple of different pieces and wearing them later, well, I hope that inspires you to take a look inside your closet 
as you begin to pack up summer and bring in fall, what are some of your favorite pieces from summer that you can now find new ways to wear into the fall and even into the early winter season? I really hope I inspired you to own your style into this next season. Come back for another video. We'll do another fun wear now, wear later, and some other good stuff will be happening here on the channel. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.